Hi guys, so today will be my charm update number 10. I can't believe 10 already. Um, and that's not really a big number, but like, um, I just looked at my charm box and I'm like, oh, I think I'm ready to have a charm collection video. So that will be coming up soon when I have time to film and have good lighting because um, I just moved on to band today. And I have theory and band minutes to do now. Um, and I have a test tomorrow, so I should um, leave the studying for tonight. So, yeah. So, I'm going to just go on to my charm update. I only have a few charms once again, because I'm trying now to have a charm update every week. If not every two weeks, because sometimes I'm not inspired by much. So, let's get started. So, I have this Mickey and Minnie Mouse inspired by Lilac Sprinkles tutorial. And... They are the old-fashioned ones, and I really love how these turned out. They are really adorable. Hers are a lot more cuter, though. So, here's my Mickey Mouse. And my Minnie Mouse. And her eye pin is over there. Then, um, inspired by, I think, Charming Delights. I, I, I forget, I'm so sorry. Um... This toothbrush and toothpaste pair. These are really cute charms. Hers are a lot cuter though. But those are... These are how mine turned out. Then I have some cubed um, characters. I think I might make a few more for my next charm update. But I only have three so far. So these are inspired by cool ice bunnies. So I have the ice cube Mamagoma. And the thing I come down, the tail of the Mamagoma looks like a little <laughs> butt. So, yeah, that's what I thought. But it's still really cute. So here's my ice cube one. And the regular Mamagoma. Oh. Then I have this Rudikina. And this is the last cubed character. Then another character I have movies is this Mimigoma butterfly and I forgot who I saw this off so I'm really sorry if you know please comment down below so I practically only used green clay for this and then I put a little bit of white clay because I'm running low on white clay and I just wrapped it around some green so yep it's my little butterfly Mimigoma I really like it how it turned out. Then I have this Earth inspired by um, ice cream scoop, and I think it's inspired by rice charms. Yeah, rice charms, and I really love how this turned out. It's my first ice cream scoop, and I'm planning to make some My Little Pony ones because I just made My Little Pony cupcakes, which I'll show you in a few minutes after I show you the cupcakes that are not inspired by My Little Pony. So I have a, um, if you've seen my last charm update, I made a bookmark version, and it was for my friend Sarah John. Um, I, I really loved how her cupcake design was, um, so I made another one. And this is a charm. Then I made this one, and Lumi Sensor 1 thought it was Princess Cadence, but it's not Princess Cadence. I'm planning to make one of her, but this is just a random cupcake. I was testing on two colors for a base. And that's one. And then this is the fail cupcake I made. I tried to make a rainbow. Apparently the back is horrible, but um, I kind of like how it turned out up here. Then I have my My Little Pony cupcakes, so let's get started. And these are inspired by Caress Bunnies. These are flat back version. I am planning to make the um, 3D version, so um, yeah, just to let you know, I'm going to make 3D version sooner or later. So... Yeah, so I have this one, and this is Fluttershy. Fluttershy is my favorite character. She acts just like me. I love animals. I'm really quiet in school. Um, I'm pretty shy, but <laughs> yeah, I guess that's practically like me. Then I have Twilight Sparkle, and I love this one. It's like my favorite other than Fluttershy, because the bread part of the cupcake is marbled with hot pink and um, this purple. I really love how the marble is. You can't really see it on camera, but it's really pretty in real life. Then I used a, um, just like Chloris Bunnies, the base is the color of the pony, the 
like bread part is the hair and this is the cutie mark with their eye color for the icing so there's um twilight speckle didn't have pinkie pie she's kind of messy over here because i tried to the cupcake um this color for me is really soft so it loses its texture really quickly so um yeah but this is pinkie pie then i have rarity and for her i used a dark purple this color and i mixed black with it and i got this really weird looking purple it looks black on camera i know it looks really ugly on camera but if you look closely it is a dark purple and yeah then i have applejack and i really like how this one turned out i should have used a darker um color for the leaf but there's the leaf over there and yeah and then here's this one and um <laughs> I don't really like how my marbled effect looks. So this is Rainbow Dash. Um, I think yours turned out way better, Lily. But um, here's mine. Um, I can't. You can't really see all the rainbow colors of her hair, though. But you can see red, blue, and green. But I mixed all rainbow colors, and her um, cutie mark looks really bad. Um, so that is Rainbow Dash. And one that um, she didn't make, but I was inspired by that, um, was Derpy. Derpy is not really a main character. You just see her sometimes. She's the pony with the cross-eyed and um, gray skin. So this is Derpy Hooves. She's a really funny character. Then the last thing I have for this charm update is this adorable friendship charm inspired by Lilac Sprinkles. I love this so much. It's my most successful. Um, let me show you. So these are these two little frogs. I forgot what the character is. I think it's not Kuropi, but it's from Sanex. And these are, um, they're on lily pads. And when you put them together, they make a heart. And it's for Valentine's Day. It's adorable. My most successful friendship bracelet, actually. And, um, I like the white one a lot better. <laughs> it's really cute. So this is the last thing for my charm update. So here's my charm update. I know it's not many charms. I'm trying to make some more for next week. So it might take two weeks, guys. Just saying. So yeah. You'll see some remakes from this charm update. Because I'm going to make 3D versions of the My Little Pony cupcakes. And then I'm going to have some more cubed characters, I think. And yeah. Bye.